What is up TCG Army, C-Money TCG here. Welcome back to another video. We've got actually probably a pretty long video for you today. I was originally going to make this into two videos, but things are pretty insane this week. Uh, work has been crazy and we have Collecticon coming up this weekend in Houston. If you're going to be at Collecticon and you see me there, please come say hi. I would love to interact with any of you, uh, meet a lot of you. Just come say hi. I'll have a lot of slabs there uh, for sale or trade as well. If you've got anything interesting, let me know. I'll be looking for vintage slabs slabs with pokemon uh dbs signature slabs stuff like that so uh come hit me up if you are interested in trying to make a deal or anything like that uh all the slabs i'm about to show you i actually have a psa return today two celebrations etbs like i said i was gonna make this into two videos but with the show coming up and everything i wanted to just go ahead and combine it into one big one uh so we do have a lot of big stuff or a lot of well a lot of big stuff but also just a lot of things to get through so without further ado please hit that like button subscribe if you are new and let's get started uh i have seen all the cards in this sub this is a smaller psa sub nothing too crazy we have a no symbol jungle scyther this is actually a present for my uh, birthday present last year in 2020 for my buddy ryan it just got back um for psa and also this is probably this is absolutely the best card in the submission right off the top is a rocket scyther ex from team rocket returns also a present for my buddy ryan he gave me this raw card as a birthday present with that other scyther he's a big scyther guy love this card love team rocket returns that got a nine uh, these these two will not be for sale at the show everything else in the submission for sale or trade uh, Charizard at GX promo. Um, yeah, the Scythers are being a present from Ryan. Those are definitely not going to be for sale. Those are going to be in uh, my personal collection. Stay there being a gift like that. Got a couple Hidden Fates cards here. Greninja, 9. With a Scizor and a 10. Very nice uh, PSA 10 Scizor. That's actually really cheap right now. Grab the cheap Hidden Fate slabs. I know the pops are crazy. This one's cool. And we actually have two of these guys. Reshiram and Zekrom GX. Rainbow from Cosmic Eclipse. This is one of my favorite. This is probably my second favorite card in Cosmic Eclipse behind the Alt Art ADP. I love this Rush Ram and Zekrom uh, with N there in the middle. The Rainbow. I'm probably going to actually keep one of these in my collection. So just one of these will be available. I will probably keep the other in my collection. Uh, a little cheap. This is like a $50 PSA 10 Inteleon. Or don't even know why I graded some of these. This was back in the kind of grade everything phase that we went through last year dragapult v full art toxtricity v max rainbow and 10 and lastly a dragapult v max and a 10 so that these were there's a pretty small submission nothing too mind-blowing by far uh this rocket scyther ex getting a 10 was a nice surprise and a really big card in this sub but other than that everything else was uh, pretty small stuff, but it will. I'll have it all with me next week, along with a ton of other slabs and stuff, uh, or this weekend at Collecticon. If you are interested in any of those, or even before, reach out to me uh, at CMoneyTCG on Instagram, CMoneyTCG at gmail.com. All right, that's it for the subs. Put those over there, and let's get into some celebrations, man. Celebrations has been a blast. Now, hit rates are sky high single prices are rock bottom but that's okay this set is so fun to open it's so nostalgic that it literally like it doesn't matter like i i love opening it everyone loves opening it so the prices of the cards literally doesn't matter it really doesn't i want to pull a gold star umbreon that's literally like all i want is a gold star umbreon or the charizard would be cool actually there's a lot of cards i'm actually probably going to try to collect this whole set um because it is a beautiful set um, and I don't care how like easy the pull rates are. It, it's just, it's a gorgeous set. It's a lot of fun. So uh, this is probably a set that I will try to uh, throw in a binder. I don't know if I'll, I'll grade an Umbreon maybe, maybe the Zard, but other than that, probably won't grade anything because just pulls are so stinking easy um, and pull rates are so nuts, but you know, it's still very fun. Let's go ahead and open up. These side packs first, we will just fly through these things. No card trick or anything like that, because y'all are here for the celebrations, just like I am. Don't really care about the other packs going on here. Green codes for days. I've not gotten a single hit out of the extra packs in the celebrations ETBs yet. I really haven't. Uh, when we opened... 
my wife Allie and I opened some of these on stream on release day. Uh, we literally did not get a single hit. Oh, we do get a hit. Rainbow Bay. Okay, that that's a decent hit. Right when I'm saying you don't get hits from these extra packs, that that will do it right there. We will. I'll take that. All right, cool. That'll do for an extra pack hit. Can we get a Zard? Nope. We have one more Darkness Ablaze. Can we get a Zard? That'd be pretty sick. How sick would it be to pull a Darkness Ablaze, Charizard VMAX, and a other Charizard in the same... Nope, Decidueye. So, there we go. That is it for the extra packs. Now for the fun stuff. The celebrations. Alright. Again, this set has been such a blast to open. I, I have enjoyed it oh so very much. And I know a lot of you have too. It's just, it's nostalgic. The hit rates are nutty. Um, it's very tiny. So you, you literally see the same cards over and over like this Lugia. Even though I am keeping all these Lugias. but And this Ho-Oh. But it's still an absolutely gorgeous set as we don't really get anything there. And I, I'm enjoying it. I really hope you guys have been having fun. Let me know if you've pulled your Umbreon, your Zard, all those things. Um, those are literally the cards I want the most. There's the Lugia. Do we have a Ho-Oh behind it? We do. Ooh, I don't have that one yet. Rockets Admin coming from that set. There we go. That's another one checked off my list. I did not have the Rockets Admin, so we will take that. Not the best card you can pull or anything, but it's one I needed for my set, so I will take that for sure. There we go. I do like the texture on all of these. I think this is my first actual video of celebrations because all the other ones we did in a stream. I will have a few more products coming in. We had that big stream if you want to go check that out. I have a couple more products coming in. Oh, oh. Foster Professor Oak and a Zama Zinta there. So there we go. I think I already had the Oak, but I'll take it. I will take it. I guess we should go ahead and sleeve this Rainbow Bay too, huh? So, so far, two cards in the Classic Collection, or whatever it's called. Which is not bad at all. And the Rainbow Bay. Not a bad little ETB so far. Let's see here if we can't get anything else, though. Let's see. Just give me the Umbreon. Gold Mew would be sweet. There's our Ho-Oh again. We have something poking through here. Surfing Pikachu VMAX. Pulled a few of these in the big stream that we did. Take that though. There we go. Still several more packs. This is, there's just hits and literally like everything, man. Like literally like every pack has hits. It's so wonderful. I love it so much. All right. There's the Dialga. Vernius, Cosmog, and a Lunala. So actually nothing in that one. That is a-okay though. There's your code. Alright, let's see here. We got what five more packs still in this ETB before we get to a whole nother ETB. We're doing alright. We're doing alright here. Groudon. Rocket Zapdos. And a full art Pikachu. We have so many Pikachus. There's the Rocket Zapdos. Very nice, very nice. I think we have the only new one is the Rockets admin for me so far. Everything else um, I have already pulled so far. So nothing new yet for me personally. So hopefully we can get a couple other things I at least need for the binder here out of this one. So I need the Garchomp. I need a bunch of stuff like that. Uh, the Tapu Lele, which apparently is impossible to pull, which is kind of crazy. Leo, so nothing in that pack. The top Ulele is randomly like the hardest card to pull, it seems. It's like gold. I need all the big three. I do not have any of the big three yet, which is kind of weird because they seem relatively easy to pull, and I have not pulled them. So I do need all the big three. Oh, Kyogre, another second serving Pikachu V Max in the CTV. Two serving Pikachu V Maxes in the same ETB. Sounds about right. There's so many Pikachus in this set. It's absurd. All right. Two more packs still. It is fun because you get the other packs. I mean, I know these only have four cards, but you get so many more packs out of these. Osmoam. Ho-Oh. 
Vernius, and Serving Pikachu V. Oh my word. So many Pikachus. Do we have any more sleeves left in this pack? I'm out of pack. I'll grab some more sleeves after this, unless we pull something nuts. Alright, last pack of this ETB. Let's finish it off strong here, hopefully. Come on now. Let's finish it off strong, hopefully. Alright, let's see here. What we got? What we got? Crowd on. Nothing. There's the Mew. Alright, so there we go. One ETB. There are all the hits. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven hits out of that one. Oh, eight hits. Eight hits out of the first ETB. One of them coming from our Vivid Voltage pack. Uh, three of the classic cards and lots of Pikachu. So there we go. Not bad. We got one more. We do have one more ETB here. Let's see what we can do out of this other one. Zard or Umbreon, man. Give me the Zard or Umbreon, or at least something from my. But I really want the Umbreon so bad. There are all the packs. Okay. Alright. There's your ETB. Go. Don't need the knife anymore. Again, we'll just fly through the other packs. Let's do them in reverse order this time. Let's do Darkness of Blaze first here. Charizard. Bizarre. All right. This is or V. Coming out of that one. Jeez, this pack just like flew apart. Green code, Swana. Put it in the wrong file. Code. Alright. Vivid Voltage. So I, just, I don't even care about the other packs. I'm going to open them because they're in here. But I literally just care about another green code. I literally just care about the celebrations. <laughs> I mean, I guess if we got something awesome out of these, that'd be sick, but... Ring code. There's that. And chilling rain. Another green code. And just like that. Alright. And there's a chilling rain. Alright. Extra packs are done. On to the celebrations. Let's see what we can do. But I do have a few more products coming in. Nothing too crazy. Like, we're getting close to the end of my celebrations product. Um, I will continue to buy this in store. Uh, ooh, Groudon. I already had that one. I already had the Groudon. But we do get a hit out of the first pack. We'll take it. I think Groudon is the most common of all the classic packs, or classic cards, if I'm not mistaken. I'm pretty sure the Groudon is the most common out of all of them. Alright, let's see what we do out of this one. There's your code. Got a surfing Pikachu. Oh, we got something. Dawn fan. That was, I don't have that one for my binder. So there we go. That's a new one for the binder. I don't know. Obviously, up. So there we go. Dawn Fan Prime. Heart Gold Soul Silver. I will sleeve that bad boy up. That's one for the binder that I did not have. So I'll take it. I will gladly take that. I said I would like to just get this whole set in a binder. If I don't get it out of the next couple, I will just buy what I have left. Um, there's your code. Do this TCA style Soul Galeo. The ground. Nothing. In that one. Yeah, I, I will gladly take the Dawn Fan Prime as long as it's something I need. Which that absolutely was. Alright. Oh, I just completely showed everything. Well, there's the whole pack right there. We built all Mew. Nothing we needed. Sad. Alright.
All right, that one came open much easier. There's a code. Zekrom. Veltal. Golgaleo. Garnius. Nothing in any of those. Ooh, what do we have? Four more packs. We're going through this one. This one has not been as kind to us as the other one so far. This one has not been nearly as kind to us so far. So let's hope these last few have a little... Oh, we got something shining through here. All right. Professor's Research. Please be something we need. Psychic. Hey, this is one of the cards I wanted was the Mew. Heck yeah. Okay, this makes me happy. This is one of the cards I really wanted. I may grade this just to have it. I may grade this strictly just to have it. Because this is one of the cards I wanted. It is a little fat over here though. It may get a 9. Oh, that makes me happy. Okay, that's exciting. I love that. I really wanted that Mew. Okay. I really want the Golden Mew too, but that makes me happy. All right. There we go, man. I am, whew, that, that that's a good pull. That one makes me very happy. Very, very, oh crap. All right. Okay, well there's the third card because I accidentally just showed it. There's a Zamazenta. All right, didn't mean to show everything. We got two packs left. But hello, Cash, he just came busting into my room. All right, we got two packs left. Pull either the Zard or the Umbreon. Can we do it? Or one of the big three, which I somehow have not pulled any of out of all the packs we've opened. All right. There's a code. Oh, oh. Mew. Kyogre. Veltal. All right, nothing in that pack. We got one pack left. One pack left to go. Give us the Zard or the Umbreon, boys. Zard or the Umbreon. Here we go. Alright. Something shiny in here for me. That. Osmog. Full Art Pikachu. Ah, Zekrom. All right, so that ETB was not as good, but we did get the better pull in the Mew EX, which I'm very excited for. That is by far the best card of the ETB to me. Uh, other than that, Groudon, Dawn Fan, some other, some of this junk. Uh, so we did get so out of the cards we needed for the binder were these two out of the two ETBs. So two cards for the binder, other two or rest of them. I mean, it kind of was we already had them. So, but it's okay, not bad. They're funny to be still a blast to open. This says so fun to open. I'm going to get this Mew EX in a sleeve ASAP because that is absolutely beautiful. And uh, that's going to be it. So, a little bit of a longer video. I am yawning as late when I'm recording this. Thank you guys so much for checking out the video. I love you guys. Catch you guys on the next one. Come see me at CollectiCon. Later. Yeah.